Welcome back. Whether you're in the mood for a documentary, a mockumentary, a drama, or something scary, Herb Stratford has something for you to watch this weekend in today's On Screen. We've got quite a mix of new titles debuting on screens large and small this week. Gabby Giffords Won't Back Down tells the story of our former Congresswoman Gabby Giffords, her relentless fight to recover following an assassination attempt in 2011, and her new life as one of the most effective activists in the battle against gun violence. A must-see film. Marcel is a one-inch tall shell who ekes out a colorful existence with his grandmother Connie and their pet Lint Allen. Once part of a sprawling community of shells, they now live alone as sole survivors of a mysterious tragedy. But when a documentary filmmaker discovers them amongst the clutter of his Airbnb, the short film he posts online brings Marcel millions of fans as well as the unprecedented dangers and new hope of finding his long lost family. Marcel the Shell with Shoes On features the voices of Jenny Slate as Marcel, Isabella Rossellini, Leslie Stahl, Rosa Salazar and Thomas Mann. The Forgiven takes place over a weekend in the Atlas Mountains of Morocco and explores the reverberations of a random accident on the lives of both the local Muslims and Western visitors to a house party in a grand villa. Ralph Fiennes, Jessica Chastain, and Matt Smith star in this pitch black tale full of loathsome characters. In the new Resident Evil series, the story takes place over two timelines. The first involving two 14-year-old sisters, Jade and Billy Wesker, moving to New Raccoon City. They come to realize their father may be concealing dark secrets that could destroy the world. The second timeline takes place over a decade in the future where only 15 million humans remain with 6 billion people being infected with a T-virus. Lance Reddick stars in this new big budget series entry into the long running film franchise. F -boys. Three women on a tropical island are joined by 24 men where half of them are self-proclaimed nice guys and the other half are F-boys. Who will the women choose and find real love with? Season two of F-Boy Island is now streaming on HBO Max and it's a wild ride. For News 4 Tucson, I'm Herb Stratford.